just getting our fingers warm, you know? My definition of the blues is life, situations, good or bad, you just put a song behind it. It's regular hard living, good living, you know, first date, last date, <laughs> you know, you just, I just happen to play a guitar and, um, and you, you know, you make a couple of words rhyme, but it's really, if you're just talking it out to a friend, it's really just situations, you're telling people the truth about your life or about other people's lives that you've heard over the years. Um, I try to write, I try to write from life experiences, mine and others. You know she left, oh she left a woman away, she's gone, my baby's gone away. Back in Chicago, I drive a bus, and I hear people's situations and stories. I see things on the street while I'm driving. Uh, situation hardships, you know, sometimes, you know, good times or whatever. And I just, I just put a story behind it. I just, uh, not a story, I just put music behind the stories and make it more contemporary. You know, sometimes I'd go to old, i do the old school blues route, you know. But for the most part, I just put music behind real life situations. It might not be true to life, but we've all, I guess some men have wanted to put a spell on a woman once in a while if she didn't like you. So it's like, I gotta get this woman somehow. So I, there's a mystical song about me putting a spell on a woman, which goes, which is, which is a throwback to the olden time blues about mojos and things like that and casting spells and, you know. So yeah, I got a, a new song called John the Conquer Root that uh, does that. Then I got a song called I've Been Better Than You and I've Been To Myself about a a foolish man that doesn't know he's foolish, you know. <laughs> but he loves this woman so much, you know, he's willing to do anything. He's late paying his rent, but he's paying her mortgage, you know, things like that. Um, there's a song called Walk It Off where sometimes you get so angry about things, you can't do anything about the situation. You just have to walk it off. It's a series of stories that's it's, uh, pretty funny that people enjoy. The blues is not a sad music, it's not sad music at all. It could be because it came from sad, uh, just desperate situations back in the 20s and the 30s and things like that. But there was also good blues too where, you know, if you got paid that night or if a woman finally, you know, gave you a date or gave you your first kiss, there's nothing blue about that. But it's all, again, I think blues now just encompasses um, real life situations, good or bad, but it's known for being bad. Blues, blue is bad, but you know, but again, blues is a good time also. You know, you might not have enough money to have a good time, but <laughs> you're gonna have a good time with that one bottle or that one woman or whatever the case is, or several women, you know, whatever, whatever floats your boat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah.